Hello class, welcome back to our online discussion and discourse research in hospitality. So in this video, we're going to discuss or I'm going to teach you on how to put a page number on your manuscript. So again, um, for your convenience, we need you need to have a three separate files. Uh, one file is for the preliminary pages, that is for the cover page down to table of contents. And then the second file is the chapter. And then the third file is the reference down to researchers' bio data. So the purpose of having those uh, separate um, files so that it can easier for you to um, edit your manuscript. Okay? And you can easily find and you can avoid uh, tremendous uh, scrolling down. Okay? So that you can easily go to the um, exact location of the pages that you're going to edit so now in this uh, video we're going to um, discuss or I'm going to teach you on how to put or insert a page number especially in the preliminary pages in which we are going to put a Roman numeral page number and for the chapters as well as in the reference down to researchers by data we're going to use only the the normal or we call it Arabic numerals okay so let's start so for the preliminary uh, preliminary pages so this is the example of a uh, cover page we need to put a page number at the upper right side of the um, paper so what you're going to do to put a page number you will go to insert and then click page number according to BISO Unified Format the page number must be located at the right side upper right side of the page so click top of page and then click plain number 3 which is the page number located at the right side click on it so as we can observe here there's a page number 1 2 3 so this format it is called a Arabic numerals or the normal numbers but according to by unified format we are going to use uh, Roman numerals for the preliminary pages okay so what we're going to do is you will uh, go back to click the insert page number and then format page numbers and then as we can observe here uh, they are using a Arabic or normal numbers 1 to 3 1 to 10 so we're going to click this one and then click the bottom part the Roman numeral the I double I triple I click on it and then click OK so as we can observe it changes the format from 1 into I from 2 into double I so this is called the Roman numerals page number and again according to by format the first section must have no page number okay so what we are going to do is to delete this one but if we will just click the backspace we will look what with what will happen if i will click the backspace okay so the letter i um, is deleted now so we will look at the other pages so the other pages is also deleted so that is the problem how we are going to uh, maintain the other pages if we will delete the first page okay so we will uh, undo this one okay so what we're going to do to erase the first page number without erasing the other pages so what we are going to do is just click on the side of this eye and then click header and footer and then after we click the header and footer we will check the uh, check box here the different first page okay if we will click the different first page the first page number is now deleted and we will look at the following pages if it is also deleted okay so this is the right format the other pages or the following pages are not following page number are not deleted 
okay so we have three here three, uh, three i dual i in the first page there is no i so this is the right format for the preliminary pages now let's proceed to the chapters so again for these chapters we need to put a page number at the top right side of the page but we're not using a roman numerals just like in the preliminary pages so we're just going to use the arabic uh, numbers or the normal numbers so again just like we have uh, done in the preliminary pages just click the insert click page number click top of page click plane number three okay so we have page number top one two three so again according to bias unified format there must have no page number in the section in the first section so we need to erase this one without erasing the other pages so what we are going to do is just uh, click in the side of number one for the header part and then click header and footer and then we will check the different first page okay so in this part uh, in the preliminary pages as we click the different first page it automatically erase the page number but on this but on this part the page number is not deleted so we will try if we if we will backspace here or delete this one if the other pages is also deleted as we uh, put a check mark in different first page so we assume that the page number other page number will not be deleted okay so we will erase this one just click backspace or type backspace okay so as we delete the first page we will check if the other pages is also deleted okay so this is the right thing the other pages are not deleted okay so this is the right format again for the preliminary pages uh, we will use a roman numerals and there must have no page number in the first part okay the cover page and then in the chapters we will use a uh, Arabic numerals or the normal numbers okay 1 to 10 or 1 to 0 or 0 to 9 and then in the first part there must have no page number okay just like this one no page number and then the second page we have number two third page we have number three okay so this is the right format this is very important so thank you for listening and watching and same with the previous module i will give you a template and then you need to uh, we will have an exercise you need to apply what you have learned from this video okay you will put a page number in preliminary pages and in the chapters thank you bye bye see you in the next video